Good Erev Shabbos, I hope you and your family are well. Looking at the whole situation, so in this week's tour portion of Balak, we have the, the wicked combination of King Balak and the prophet Bilam, who come to curse the Jewish people in combination. So the king had uh, an understanding of discerning of a certain place where the curse would be effective, and Bilam knew the time. And the king said to, uh, to, to Bilam, come with me and I'll show you the edge of the camp, but look at that, but don't look at the whole camp. And from there, that's where the curse will be effective. And the message is very, very powerful. In the world that we live in, uh, centered around the media and the news that we hear, we often show the extremities of what humanity is. And we start to come to believe that the world is negative and, and there's curses and, and, there, and there's bad in the world. And that's what the picture that we see and it leads to lots of, lots of anxiety. Obviously, there are challenging things which happen in the world. But actually, if you look at the whole picture, the whole of humanity, there's extreme amount of goodness. And we can see that with um, the individuals, with nations, with societies, that we need to start conditioning ourselves to the opposite way of media. Obviously, we have to be keeping up with the news, knowing what's going on, but actually be able to, to see the whole picture and know that there's a lot of good. A couple of weeks ago, we had the honor of going to the Yoni Jesna Awards, where our son Yehuda Leib received an award. And actually, it was celebrating the tremendous amount of kindness which is done within the community. And we know that actually, if we look carefully and see the whole picture we know there's a lot of good going on so I will encourage us if we want to live a, a life of curses um, a life of negativity so only look at the extremities if you want to live a life of blessing to see the good and know that there's good look at the whole picture and realize that there is good and that often is the majority um, and let's hang on to that so as we go into Shabbos let's consider um, ourselves seeing the good in ourselves seeing the good in our family in our community in the world and through that we bring out blessing and not curse into this world wishing you and your family a wonderful healthy blessed Shabbos